Hello everybody and a good day to you all today. I am talking about Supergirl episode number 13, Mr. and Mrs. Pitlick. This episode directed by um, Stefan Polinsky and we have a Valentine's Day story because love is in the air. And we have Kara and we have Manel and Kara finally decided to confess her true feelings for Manel and it looks like they're going to start to become a couple. That's nice. Sweet. But then, out of the fifth dimension, come Mr. Pitlick, and he wants to confess his love for Kara, and he pretty much tells her that we will get married. And my dog like this, what? what? What are you doing? And he pretty much telling Kara that we got to get rid of this guy because he's nothing but he, he's nothing but trouble. He has way too much power. He has no response. He takes no responsibility for his actions. And he's going. He said he's dangerous. We got to get rid of him. And Kara like this. I can handle this. I don't need you to fight my battles for me. I can take care of this. I am a strong, independent woman, and I don't need no man to tell me how to handle mine. Yeah, okay, fine, whatever. So you got that little, little triangle going on there. And then you have Alex, and then you have Maggie. And you have Alex, who wants to pretty much share her love with her girlfriend on this day. Because Alex loved Valentine's Day. She, she grew up loving Valentine's Day. And so she turns to Maggie, who she's in love with, and she wants to share the special day with her. And then Maggie is like, Valentine's Day sucks. It's just some manufactured piece of crap to, to play on suckers. And Alex is heartbroken, and she doesn't want to tell Maggie how she really feels, but she just buries it inside of her like a sad person. Her heart's breaking, she's crying, and she wants to be with her girlfriend on a special day, and her girlfriend's about this, no! Because this day is nothing but crap! Oh. Then you have Wynn, and Wynn is usually the guy who doesn't get the girl, and when he doesn't get the girl, she turns, she, she turns evil, like Banshee did. But this time, he finds a girl, he finds Laura, who is an alien, and Laura is played by um, Tab, um, Tamsin, a merchant, and Looks like they're starting to form some type of special relationship going on here. And now, now it's not weird for um Wynn to fall in love with an alien because he fell in love with Kara. But this time, um, Laura she stands out because she can tell she's an alien. She doesn't pass as human. So you, you see them dealing with that in in the, um in this episode right here because um, from her point of view, she has been she probably had been with plenty of humans before, but they just wanted the, the experience of being with a human. But when, on the other hand, actually wants to know her, actually wants to build a relationship with her, which is nice. So that was going on in this episode right here. You got pretty much this is a, a whole crazy love story. And I'd say I really did enjoy it a whole lot. I mean, it made some quite changes to Mr. Picklet. I mean, he does he does that small little imp with the funny hairdo and some of that in this episode right here. It made him look a little more sexier and more nice looking. There's nothing wrong with that. But he still had a feel of Mr. Uh, Mr. Picklet. Oh my God, just saying that name is driving me crazy. But, he still had that feel. He's still kind of crazy. The little silly, a little out there, and it brought a lot, of, it brought a, little, a lot of humor to the show that I did, I did enjoy. Um, just watching her pop up and doing all this crazy stuff that to try to get Carol's attention, I did enjoy. I enjoyed that a whole lot. And this is this is this, this is overall a fun episode. Just a fun, fun episode. It didn't really hurt this hurt, hurt the um, the story not going through and then like improve it on it in any type of way. It's just a fun, nice distraction that I, I, I just I enjoyed. I enjoyed it a whole lot. I think the guy who played Mrs. Pickleleg, um Peter um um Gad Gadot, how do you say his name? I don't know. Any uh, anyway, I think he did an amazing job as as um Mr. M, Mr. M. Boy, just saying his name is just hard. Anyway. I didn't enjoy him as a character. So overall, great show, fun show. Really didn't enjoy it a whole lot. Had me laughing. I, I didn't I didn't I enjoyed it. So leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about the episode of Supergirl. And that's pretty much all I gotta say about that. So give my channel a big like it thumbs up. Boom. And subscribe to my channel and share. I really appreciate it. Like I always say in my dreams and in real life, I am the ninja rabbit. Uh peace out of people.